if you want to know how to save file in Clipchamp, you've come to the right place. So we have two options of how can we save. Basically, if we created this project and we want to continue uh, to work with it a little bit later, we can easily click on this icon in the left top corner and we'll go to back to files uh, folder. And after that, our project will be automatically saved. So we don't have to click somewhere to find some folders, to find some actions, to find some features. We can find it later right up here on this area. So from our home page, from our like main page inside of the Clipchum, just simply scroll down and we'll be able to find all this stuff. But make sure that all the media you've imported is now available because sometimes you can have some issues with interacting with media inside of the project. So you may have to import it once more from your computer. And the other way of how can we save file in Clipchamp is just simply export our video. So we can click on export, then just choose the necessary quality, for example, the lowest one in my case. And in a few seconds, our video will be automatically exported to our computer and it will be automatically saved. But make sure that uh, all the edits were created and you don't want to add something more because you won't be able to interact with the elements. So if you have a lot of different stuff inside, you won't be able to edit it a little bit later. So there is no option to save like project on your computer. You can only export a video on your computer. So you'll be able to find the result of your work. You don't, you won't be able to save the whole project with all the timeline elements and so on. So these are two ways of how can we save file in Clipchamp. Hope this video helped you out. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. Goodbye.